Hey, Facebook and YouTubers, Marshall here. Hey, uh, just wanted to make uh, this video. Uh, I'll be making a, a, a much longer, more detailed um, kind of update video on uh, burning black diesel uh, in the uh, little Chinese diesel heaters. But here's something that I wanted to um, let folks know about. You may, may or may not uh, know about it, but I wanted to uh, just make a video. I've not seen anyone discuss this or talk about this. Uh, so these particular units, you can run them on a range of voltages as low as uh, 10 uh, or 11 volts and as high as uh, the high cutoff is 14.6 um, with you. Uh, and, and I wanted to specifically talk about the, the voltage uh, that you are seeing even here on your screen. So regardless of what we do, this is what I wanted to focus on. These heaters really run best uh, that the RPM of the fan, uh, both the combustion fan as well as the uh, air circulation fan, you know, the air that comes out of the tube and, and, and ultimately warms, uh, warms the room, that the RPM of that fan uh, is, is, is directly related to the voltage. Um, for those of you that are running it uh, maybe at 11 or 12 volts, um, um, I'll tell you that if you were running at 13 or 14 volts, you would see a noticeable difference in the RPM, maximum RPM speed uh, of the fan blower itself. Um, and so knowing that, that the more air, especially when we talk talking about alternative fuels, uh, certainly, um, but you know, even those that really have a lot of extra soot going on, uh, even running just plain diesel, if you're, uh, you know, depending on uh, elevation and your settings, um, you know, you could potentially still be running, um, you know, running too rich. So increasing the fan speed is both going to give the combustion chamber more air, uh, which is really what's really important uh, if you're in a, you know, running really too rich, uh, getting a lot of that black sooty um, uh, exhaust, uh, you know, uh, lining the insides of your burn chamber. Anyways, let's get to it. So these power supplies um, are, are what almost everybody is 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 using. Who's got these set up in a in a, a non-mobile kind of situation, right? If you're not putting this in a in a camper or a, or a van or something, uh, these are the popular power supplies you can find on Amazon. Um, and so when these ship out of the box, I was very I put a multimeter on it. I wanted to see what the power uh, rating was, or what the, what the voltage was, um, you know, right out of the package. And it was 12.6 uh, volts. So right out of the box, these things are putting out 12.6 volts. And the reason why I say that is, is that some of you may not know, but if you look on your your PC board, they're all the way to the left. So you've got all your terminals here where your wires are coming in. Uh, this is my AC and in, in ground. Uh, and then this is the voltage you near know, these are the two power uh, leads that go to the to the heater. But that little yellow pot down there in the in the bottom left hand, I'm gonna zoom in here and let you see it. So it's a little it's a little they call a pot, P-O-T. It's a little adjustment pot. Um, and um, uh, what that's used for is adjusting the voltage uh, that come, that the that the transformer is creating. Uh, and these have a range, uh, so I was curious to find out, and, and out of the box it was 12.6. If you turn this pot Clockwise. Take a Phillips screwdriver. It, it doesn't take a lot of force. A small screwdriver is really all you need. If you turn that pot clockwise, you're gonna you're gonna be able to turn the voltage up ever so slightly. Again, the maximum voltage uh, was 14, um, but 14 volts is certainly better than 12.6, especially if you're gonna make your combustion fan uh, turn that much faster. So I recommend you know if you uh, you know if you're seeing 12 volts when you when you connect this power supply up and you uh, you know turned on your unit um, you know you're probably I would suspect that you're looking you're probably seeing 12 volts um, you know right out of the box and so by making that pot adjustment turning that pot up uh, you know now you're going to get closer to 13 or 14 volts so just wanted to put that out for you guys um, and uh, I promise you'll be making a more detailed video and update on the black diesel. Uh, we've made a number of changes, including uh, changing the, uh, the actual uh, combustion uh, burn pot configuration uh, to, uh, to really help with, um, 
uh, the, uh, the the alternative fuels and in the in the, the debris that we're finding uh, that ends up blocking the uh, the burner inside the combustion chamber. So uh, I'll give a detailed video on that. Very very exciting. Uh, really happy here. This has been running uh, nonstop. Um, have not made any any adjustments or changes to it. Uh, it's just kind of sitting here churning and burning, if you will. Uh, so really really happy. More videos to come soon, guys. Uh, thank you very much. Talk to you soon.